story is it was two days after the war and this U-boat wouldn't surrender. That's the mystery. All the uh, U-boats had surrendered apart from this one. Why didn't it surrender? It was always said that it was full of Nazi gold. Why wouldn't it surrender? So that's what gets us thinking. What was it? What was it hiding? So much mystery to it. You never know. The, the Nazi gold might still be here. A hoard of historic treasures have been found inside a sunken German U-boat. The Echo was granted rare access inside the U-boat, which is said to contain Nazi gold. German U-boat U-534 lay on the seabed for almost 50 years after being hit by an RAF death charge. The remains of the submarine contained an unexpected treasure trove when it was dragged up from the seabed. In the years following, it became the interest of Nazi gold hunters after it was destroyed by British forces at the end of World War II. The story goes, the U-boat had headed out of Germany in May 1945 as news of the German surrender came through. All U-boats had been ordered to surrender, but U-534 left Kiel hours before with some believing it was carrying Nazi gold. Having met up with a convoy of German submarines, it continued sailing north. It was there the fleeing U-boats were attacked by bombers from the RAF 86 squadron while heading towards Norway. The submarine crew managed to shoot one bomber down, but received a direct hit by a death charge dropped from one of the Allied planes. U-534 began to take on water as a result of the damage and sank near the Danish island of Anholt. It wasn't until nearly 50 years later that U-534 was brought to the surface amid rumours that as the last Nazi U-boat to leave Germany, it could be laden with Nazi gold. Mystery surrounds the U-boat's purpose and why it was fleeing despite the strict orders of surrendering Nazi leaders. It is not known why the submarine did not surrender. A horde of previously unseen artefacts and treasures hidden away in the U-boat have now been uncovered. Historians at Education and Heritage Specialist Big Heritage are now sifting through thousands of previously unseen artefacts left untouched since 1945. Some of the items will be dusted off and go on display at Western Approaches, a former secret underground World War II bunker in Liverpool city centre used to orchestrate the Atlantic war effort. U-534 is a preserved relic and currently stands as a living museum in Birkenhead Docks. Why didn't it surrender? It was always said that it was full of Nazi gold. Why wouldn't it surrender? That's what gets us thinking, what was it, what was it hiding? So much mystery to it. You never know, the, the Nazi gold might still be here.